Hello, welcome to another practice problem from Algebra Test Helper. So what we're going to be doing here is solving this basic equation, x minus 3 equals 10. Okay, so the first thing you want to do to solve for x is add a 3 to both sides of the equation. Now remember in algebra, we're solving an equation. You can do whatever you want to do to one side of the equation, or you can do whatever you want to do to the equation, as long as you do it equally to both sides. So in this case, I'm adding 3 to both sides of the equation. And that's not going to change the equation. All it's going to do is set me up to be, be able to solve for x. Okay, so <clears throat> what I'm going to do now is going to add down in a column manner. And notice where I wrote the plus 3. Okay, I wrote it right underneath these numbers just like this. So that's how you want to do it. You want to kind of copy the format of the way I'm working these problems. So x minus 3 equals 10. So to solve for x, i got to add 3 to both sides of the equation. Now let's go, go, let's go ahead and take a look at this first column. I have x plus nothing is simply x minus 3 plus 3 is 0. Okay, so I'm not going to put anything there. And I have my equal sign, and I have 10 plus 3 is 13. So my solution is x equals 13. And of course, we want to write that this way. Okay, so x equals 13. But this is the mechanics of what's going on to solve a basic equation like this. So what you want to do is come check out our website, algebratesthelper.com, and subscribe to my YouTube channel here. And we're going to be doing a ton of free algebra practice prompts. So if you're taking algebra, this is going to be a really, really helpful site for you. So have a great day.